At Moe's, our honestly awesome food is truly groundbreaking. Come in today for a burrito bowl freshly made just for you. Started off a little slow, uh, a few penalties called back, uh, a couple of big runs that put us in scoring position, uh, fumbled down on the goal line, so we started off slow. But I'm pleased, I'm pleased with the win. Uh, any win is a big win, so uh, we'll take it. We had a pretty good game. Came out there executed our pleas, made reads, made catches. And our defense was just making stops the whole game, so we had a pretty solid game. Tonight it was pretty much a dog fight. We came out early in the first quarter. We was getting down the field and we wasn't just converting on our plays and our drive. So we came back out, we converted, and we played hard. Today we just came out there, we played we slow a little at first, but uh, we had to go out there and show the team that we were a better team. Uh, one of my games that we had. Uh, I mean, Andy River, they came out and played a good game. I mean, our part, we need to execute more down there. We had two trips down in the red zone where we didn't execute. So we got to pick up and come back at practice at 9 a.m. tomorrow. But overall, in the river, they played a good game. They got our respect. Talk about your, you guys' execution offensively from uh, the first half to the second half. We, it really wasn't an adjustment. It was more of an attitude, a mentality adjustment. Just going to our kids and just telling them, hey, you're not playing any river football. And they came out in the second half and, you know, they buckled down. I think they were a little frustrated by, you know, some of the things that were going on on the field, the adversity that was going on. And once they settled down, you started to see any River football. First half, we would, we would get down there, we would get in the position we want to be, and then we would make a mistake. Second half, we came out, we were just firing. That's how we ended up putting up all those points so fast. We came out, we ran our tempo, ran our pleas, executed, and we converted on what they gave us. We started off a little bit slow. We were, we were moving the ball, but we were starting off slow. But second half, we picked it up fast. And we was rapid offense, lined up on the ball, pushing the ball downfield. What was the difference between the first half and the last three series for you guys? I mean, first half, we was we, no execution at all, no execution. Then the last three series, we just got on the sideline. I talked to my offense and said, we just need to drive down the field and just execute, get what we can. It seems like this uh, this team is getting better each week. Talk about the improvements from week one to now. Week one, week one was a wake-up call for us, knowing that we're not unbeatable. That was the biggest thing that we got out of week one. We're not unbeatable. We can't take any team like So this is what we've been doing these past two weeks, and we're just going to keep keep it going. Last week it was Devin. Had a big game this week. Devin, Jermeek, myself, Griff, everybody had a big game this week. So. We know going in Kings Fort, they were going to be confident. They were two and no, they were undefeated. So we just knew we went in there, played our game. We wouldn't have anything to worry about. Talk about your role in tonight's game because it looked like they really got the ball to you in clutch situations. Tonight I was just the, the dog, the dog of the team. We needed, we needed a deep third down, they'd give me the ball. If we needed a first down, like right then, they'd give me the ball. So I mean, they was opening it up for me and but my teammates like Devin Hunter, Keyshawn Brown, Jameek Knight, Jerry and Christopher, they were opening up for me also. So they was keeping the key away from me. Talk about being able to defend uh, Justin German, man, the very athletic quarterback over there. It was a task. It was a tough task, man. Uh, he's a very athletic quarterback. Uh, he makes good decisions. He knows when to throw the football, when not to throw the football. Uh, so we knew that going into the game that in order for us to uh, win the game, we had to contain him. And we contained him for the most part until the last uh, five minutes of the game. I mean, our game plan was just to come out here and play fast and physical and execute. But we see, I mean, the outcome. But overall, we still, we're still a good team. And the they just outplayed us tonight. And we just got to come back next week, beat Western Branch. How was it getting out there playing against your good friend and uh, Justin German? It was good. Uh, I actually made a tackle on the one play, but it was good. Uh, Justin, it's like my little brother. We grew up together. And at the end of the day, I love him. But I mean, this is, this is my first time playing on the actual opposite side of the ball of him. So it's going to be the last time for what I think. And it was good for what it was. And still my boy. Um, we go way back. That's like my brother. So it was pretty much like what we used to do, backyard football. So it was, it was a good experience to play with him. And as him as a quarterback, so you get to talk junk here and there. What did you say to him after you uh, 
caught an interception. Caught it. <laughs> I was like, I got you, boy. Give me one. I want to know one. <laughs> I mean, going to Gums against them, it was just like old days back in like practice. I mean, they like my brother, so it was just fun. All right, you got another one down, another victory, another game next week. Uh, what do you do prepare? What, what, what's the preparation for next week's game against Rasville? Just keep plugging away. Uh, just going men mental part. I think it's more mental with us uh, because you know we we've had so much success so fast that the kids kind of walk out and they try to they kind of expect it. And I keep preaching, and coach keep preaching that we gotta earn everything we get because we're gonna get everybody's best shot. So it's not really an adjustment thing where we're going out there, we're trying anything new. It's more or less executing what we're doing and changing the mentality of executing it.